All right, so first thing. That's my jam. That's, that's awesome. You know, if it was only that easy to end up in charge of a thing. You guys, you guys are new around here. Let me just put that there. You guys are new around here. Let me give you a, a, a quick, a quickest of possible summaries. This is a group of people who are amazing. They've only told one lie in the entire time I've known them. About three years ago, we were asked, do you think you have the skills to put together a professional theatrical event? And we said yes. <laughs> and we did really, really badly. And after three years of every single Monday night, which is now we took two off ultimately for our holidays that lined up weird and we moved to a venue that's four times the size which we have cards up front and we'll tell you about that later but we've done 150 this is 156 shows the circus freaks who you will see some of tonight are performers in my company that helped put this all together. The, all the people around you that are making this happen are actually circus performers, theatrical performers, musicians. They come together to make this thing happen. Yeah. It is a theatrical experience that is based on a simple idea. In order for us to do anything good, we have to feel safe to take risks. That means we have to trust each other and that's why we've worked together as long as we have. And it also means that we need support from an audience, which you guys clearly give us buckets of, so I'm gonna shut up about it. <laughs> but I will say this, one of the most amazing things that we've never done before is to pick up all of this stuff from its safe little greenhouse, carry it to a new place and unpack it. While we've done circus events and we've done shows and we've done all sorts of stuff, we've never brought this particular event anywhere. You are the first audience to see our road show. So, Thank you for being the best test audience ever because you are so supportive. And tonight is going to be a bit of a sampler. It's gonna show you a little bit of the kinds of things we do. It, there's so many performing. Realize with 155 shows, week after week, we see new things every week. Anything you can imagine, it's probably happened. Zombie acapella has happened. <laughs> Zentai burlesque. I mean, just things, I know, aerial silks, acrobatics, clowns, everything you could possibly imagine has happened and more. And it's happened in a room full of people who said, yeah, give me that. I'm sorry? We have not done that yet because we didn't have the space until recently. You see, six months ago, we moved to a space. You're crammed into a sardine can and I'm sorry for that because our actual home is about five or six times the size of this room with mirrors and lights and lots of room to dance and play. Normally in our intermission, we have an hour where you guys get to get up and move around and go crazy. We're not gonna do that much of that tonight, but we're gonna do a lot of other stuff and we're gonna get you very involved, okay? Okay. You guys have heard so much freaking talking and you've been so good. It's the hardest part of the experience is we have to infect you with our brains. So how we're gonna start the show is like this. I'm gonna start the show with a simple trick. There's no fourth wall here. When you scream, we do hear you, so do scream and scream supportively. 